What's up, you guys? So today I'm going to be telling you guys about the Andy Warhol collaboration with NARS. I know that this is a old collaboration, but I actually found it on eBay for $14.99 and I couldn't help but get it. I was so intrigued with the packaging. As you can see, it comes in a can. I love, 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 love it. It is super, super pretty. I'm going to zoom in on it so you guys can see a little bit more. But look at the packaging on here, you guys. And it also has like all of the ingredients and the shades at the bottom. Shows the shade range, which is really, really cool. And it also came um, in the can like this. It had this little um, black circle covering the top, um, protecting it so the top of the lip glosses won't get scratched. And it also came with a NARS pamphlet with some information on Andy Warhol. So, you guys, these are all of the swatches so far. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Basically, all of them are glosses. And I feel like all of these colors can complement someone um, of any skin tone, which it, I really, really did like about the product so far. So, the first color I have on my lips is basically the... Sorry, y'all. I'm sorry if y'all heard my dad. But, um... Like I was saying, the color that I have on my lips now is this pink one, and it is called, I think it's Drila. I'm not going to say all the names on here because some of the names you can't really see on here due to the um the sticker, like where the sticker is on at where the sticker is on the bottom. So this is the first color, and it has a hint of that pink, and I really do like that. It makes my lips like feel, I don't know. Like, the formula isn't sticky whatsoever, so thumbs up on that one. I'm going to definitely try the next ones, too, so keep on watching. Next, I have this beautiful clear glitter lip gloss. I am truly obsessed with this, you guys. Like, look at the glitters in here. Like, they are so, so pretty, so I'm definitely going to try this on. I don't really care too much for the applicator. This is how the applicator looks, you guys, and I don't really like this too much. Cause I feel like you don't get a you don't get a lot of product on your lips. So there you go. You can see some of the glitters in the lighting. Super cute. This is mainly like my least favorite. I feel like if I have like a matte gloss on and like a matte lip on, then I can apply this gloss on it. But other than that. Mm, not really my cup of tea. So we have three more shades left to try. So let me go ahead and try those. I'm kind of over pausing the video and then applying it on again. So this one is more like a, a nude brown gloss. I'm going to definitely try this on. I hate like going back in it. This one has a little bit more pigment. And this one also is a little bit sticky. But I like this color. I'm going to see how it looks with the glitter on top. Yeah, I can rock this one. I like that. I really like this one. So I have two more shades, and it is this pinky nude as well. And just to let you guys know, none of the lip glosses have um, any smells to it. Which I'm actually happy about, but then again, I don't know. I'm kind of undecided on that. Oh, that one's pretty too. And then with like the glitter gloss on top. Oh yeah. That one's super pretty. And then the last one is more of a a dark nude. So we're definitely gonna try this one on too. Oh yeah, 
this one definitely has to be my favorite. I would say that this nude is my favorite as well as the dark pink lip gloss. I really do love these two. Mm, it's so pretty. I'm definitely going to add some of the other color on with this one. Just add it down in the middle. Mm. I like this, you guys. This is really, really pretty. I feel like their packaging is definitely on point. I really do. I, I love the packaging. The packaging is what sold me on the product anyway. So congratulations to Nars because that's basically how you sold your product to me. But I really do love this. I feel like it's a really good collector's item, especially if um, you like to collect certain makeup and stuff like that. I, re I don't really collect makeup. I mainly like mascara, lip glosses, and stuff like that. But, you know, I really do like this. The packaging was amazing so far. And I love all of the glosses except for the glitter gloss. I thought that the glitter gloss was going to be one of my favorites, but it really wasn't. But I hope you guys enjoyed the short video. Like I said, I know that, you know, it's basically an old item probably it probably brought this out like two three years ago but it's whatever i still like it i think it's super cute a great collective um item so i hope you guys enjoyed this short video don't forget to comment like and subscribe and always remember make sure you tell your friends to come out and let your friends so we all can be friends i love you guys oh so much and make sure you come back every week for more videos